Today we're looking at testing vehicle charging points using the MFT1741 Plus and the EVCA210 vehicle charging adapter. We're going to do an earth loop test and the RCD tests using the MFT1741 Plus. It's the normal setup to start with on the loop test, so you put it on the LPE and the Z function and it will come up default to the three low because we're testing through the vehicle charging point that has a 6 milliamp DC monitor, we have to change the setting within the unit by pressing the mode key, which will change from mode 1 to mode 2, which utilises the type B symbol on the bottom of the screen. We can then do a test through that monitor without it tripping it. You can see there, we end up with a reading of 0.96 and a perspective fault current of 0.24 kilo KA. We can then do our automatic RCD test, very simple to set, auto and EV. That does the six AC tests followed by the two DC ramp tests. And if I set the test off, it will go through as normal, doing the two half times at 0 and 180 degrees, which it shouldn't trip. And it will then go on to the one times where it will trip. Now, unlike most RCD testing, you do have to wait for the, uh, the actual charging point to reset itself. So it will take a lot longer than perhaps you're used to when you're testing on a normal RCD. And it does depend on which charging point you're using, the speed at which it does it. Once you've got it back on, it will trip almost immediately. Once you get to the DC ramp test, it's a lot simpler to reset simply by returning to A and putting it back to C on the EVCA. It resets it and then goes into the second half of the test. And that now completes the test. Comes up with end on your screen and if we scroll through, you can see the readings that were taken during the test.